Alright, a short disclaimer before the video. Uh, this level are all taken from the level that I have uploaded to my channel. So if a level you think should be here isn't here, then that is probably why. So don't go to the comment section yet. Keyboard warrior, calm down. The first level of the month is City Beat by Anyglab. Okay, so you can already see this is a good level just from the start here. There is a lot of custom objects, the background is nice, and there are some fancy animations with the flying car and stuff. But this is just the tip of the iceberg, it gets even better. Now you can already see here the attention to detail already increased greatly. And we also have some pretty cool effect with the recording there. And here you can see the effect with the light and shadow are so nice. That I cannot stress enough how much attention the creator put there. But this part I don't like so much, the background is not nice at all, but everything else seems so out of place compared to the rest of the levels. But that is just the appetizer, this is the main course. You can see while the theme is similar, it's still the same, but there is still a lot of variety in the block design, which is very nice to see. But this is the best part, the boss fight. Like the thing is perfect, the animation of the boss is very smooth, the gameplay feels good to play, and it's just perfect really. And to top it all off, it even have multiple bosses. And there is slight difference between the boss fight. Like the first boss fight, it tells you where you shouldn't go. And now it is telling you where you need to go. And while the difference might seem minuscule at first, for the player's experience, it actually brings a lot to the table. Next, we have Fantastic Dreams by Pai Shou GD. Okay, so this is the only demon level that I've featured in this video and it starts out slow but you can already see it has some nice background going on there some nice sing sing and here you can see the background has a lot more nice animation a lot more moving parts going on and there's even some effect going on with the foreground some pulsing according to the music and so the foreground the background is nice the effect is nice and the block design is a little bit simple but you can still see a little bit of small detail going on in there like those small flower pot there uh, but i still have one complaint about this level it's just a small one uh, like while those blocks have some good design on there like those triangles are pretty cool i don't think the creator did a very good job in trying to show this design show the detail on the block like look at those blocks they actually have a good design on them but it's hard to see because of the flashing going on I think the stretch are way too bright. I turn that down a bit and this level will be perfect in my opinion. Like, if you are going to design this vlog, then why hide it? Like, show your creation. Show all those details. Uh, for this part, it has some really nice wind current effect going on. And like, the block here, you can see the design. Like, this is perfect. But, uh, at the previous part, I just don't like it that much. Uh, but still, overall, it's still a very great level. I just have one complaint and it's just a minor one at that. It also has a free coin and a free spike for you to chew on. So 9.5 out of 10. Then we have On My Way by Giselle. I never plan to put any normal level in here and I never expect myself to have to put any normal level in this type of video. But this level is just too good to not put. Like look at those background. Look at all those block design. Look at that. Look at all those effects going on. Those color change those lyrics those arrow those li effects on the lyric like, everything is so good like, you don't expect anything from the gameplay but even here we have some pretty interesting gameplay going on where you need to stick to the dash block there to get the coin like it's a normal level no one expect anything from the gameplay and yet there we go and look at this animation it's so good man and even after all that, we still have some creative gameplay going on. We are playing as a robot here, and you need to shoot this thing. Well done. No, you are well done. Like, it's so good, the background, the animation. Maybe that second coin is a little bit bad, but... In the end... What a good number level. What an amazing level, in general, really. Next level is Summer Teen by Mark. Okay, so this level is on the simpler side of the spectrum, but just because it is simple doesn't mean it lacks details, which is what the simple level I usually know for. 
But you can see here those palm trees swing in the wind and that red bucket that fall over when you touch it. This level just because its theme is simple, doesn't lack detail, it still has some depth to it. And this is a collaboration between six different creators, so you will be able to see a lot of different style put into it. But just because it's, it is made by different people, they still manage to keep the theme the same it, uh, across the levels. And the session doesn't feel like six different things being forced to fit in with each other. It feels like it blends very well together and the end result just feels very well polished. And for each creator, they really did a good job for each of their part. Everyone is carrying their own weights, no one is slacking off, no one is being lazy. The block design are great, the background are great. It even has some pretty nice end screen here. Some pretty nice art and animation. And the gameplay is okay. But in all, probably the best collabs I have played this last month. The last one is Blocktober GD 2020 by Earthem. Okay, so a little bit of background before I actually talk about the level. So Blocktober GD 2020 is an event where GD creator create a block design based on a prompt. They are given with one word for one day. And this creator decide to combine all of their submission for the event into one whole level. And the result is this level, which is probably the level with the most team I have ever played. And while that is an interesting concept, just a concept obviously isn't enough. But this creator obviously have the ability and skill to execute it perfectly too. That all of these different sections actually has a lot of attention and love put into them. You can see the block design are very well made, the background is very nice to look at. Not just for one or two of the team, but for almost all of them. It's hard for me to find a team that looks bad even if you judge it just based off its own parts. And the end result is just fantastic really. My only complaint would probably be that last co the coin is just kinda BS really. Thank you for watching. See you in the next video.